Breaking news! The Chuck E. Cheese mystery surprise egg has been found at Walmart. Just look at the Barbie aisle and look down. That's where the eggs are. In other news, badgers. Do we need them? So if you've seen the the news segment or seen the title or read the thumbnail or no, seen the seen the thumbnail and read the title. Yeah. Then you know I got this thing. And I don't th as of making this on the 29th, 28th, yeah, 28th. I haven't I've only seen one person make a review on this and I'm pretty sure he's not a good person unless he's like one of the ones that are surprisingly again we're not getting in that today so it's pretty cool it looks like an it's an egg but it's Chuck E. Cheese like it's a like it has his hair has his ears and on the back you can see all the stuff that you can collect I think that's an, a new render, but I could be wrong. Same with this one, but I think that's on like the some like the um what's it called the doors? You know, the, when you walk into Chuck E. Cheese. I don't know what I'm talking about. So on in this egg, you can get a squishy head, a skateboard, um, a fidget spinner. Five hundred, at least five hundred e-tickets, four stickers, and two trading cards. So these are twenty dollars a pop. So twenty-one dollars, including tax, because it's America. Unless you don't live in America, and I don't know how your currency works. So, so. So I'm going to open this and you're going to watch it if you want. So, yeah. So I took off the skin, or not skin, like the paper. Why did I say skin? I took off the like plastic over it and there's a C there. It's like a forehead thing. So, yeah. It's hard to do this with one hand. Um, if you're wondering what the, what the inside... And also, if you're wondering why am I doing this, I'm giving you the whole experience. Because the guy that did it was like, Okay, guys, today you, it's a Chuck E. Cheese egg. Oh, my goodness. So, let's see. Oh, it's a squishy. Oh, it's a race car. Oh, let's get these Funko Racers to see if this if it goes it's, it's, just be real show them what they really want how the it looks like on the inside so does that and there's these pretty cool plastic things could be like a bowl or like a jacuzzi for a barbie where is that Huh, that's weird. So, there's one, two, three, four bags. Um, and there's this also. So, yeah. Just gonna. I'm gonna start with this. So, I'm gonna do that. So uh, I, I see a like a pamphlet. I'm gonna hang this on my wall right there, uh, where you can see what you can collect. And I've never heard of Bonkers, but they're the people that make it. Age is three plus. Good. I not. I don't have my fake ID anymore. Um. So a Jasper sticker. That's pretty cool. Could put that on my lunchbox. Uh. Ooh, a Chucky and a Helen trading cards. 
pretty cool, pretty cool. And a Munch's Make Believe sticker. I would be angry that they're not in their, like, regular thing, but they can't really because of Bella. And also, if you're, if you're a true fan of just Chuck E. Cheese or me, let me know your opinion on Bella. And let me know if you're, like, how you feel about it. Because as a character, I think she's okay. But, like, I don't know. So, there's Pasquale playing the drums. There's Helen singing. And something for a thing for a bunch of e tickets. Oh, I got, I got until 2026. Uh, on December 31st, 2026. Wow. Hopefully I live that long. I think I'll wait to open the squishy egg last. So, that's all what was in the first bag. I, I'm guessing the fidget spinner. I should probably put these in the thing and... As I take them out. Yeah, so I don't make a mess on the table because I just cleaned it up. I know you don't care. You don't have to put in the comments, I didn't ask. Why didn't, why did you click on the video? So, oh this is pretty heavy. I wasn't expecting it to be this heavy. So it's just a Chuck E. Cheese fidget spinner. Pretty actually good quality. I was expecting it to be like one of like the like the coloring book stickers. But no, it's just it's literally printed on there. Huh. That's cool. So that's all was what was in this bag. I like most times Chuck E. Cheese. I know this is kinda controversial. But I it's starting to grow on me the 2.0 thing because like if you don't think about like all the like whatever like the stores close not closing like people not wanting to go because the animatronics are gone but like I don't know I don't know what I'm talking about I got the Pasquale. Pasquale is like my second favorite. I don't know what order, but he's just my second favorite. Or my first. Ooh. And there's the old, like, old picture. Like, not old picture. Old signature. And there's Chuck E. Cheese. And it surprisingly hurts for, like, a children's toy. Like, you could really hurt your knee if you like just went at it and just went like ear, 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 on the side you're not supposed to go ear, ear, with so you could really hurt your knee so let's see if i can do a kickflip i don't think you can see it but i'm trying oh i did it yeah okay so let's do the the best love not best, like just see what the last one is. I think it's Chucky. It's... I really... This isn't how I thought it would be. I'm not disappointed. But this... It's not how I thought it would be. Like, I'll, I'll go get it. Give me a second. I got this, like... Three... Four... Wow, four. No. Two. I have no idea how time works. 
don't get mad at me, please. So I got this. This isn't, like, filled with water. It's just a bit of, like, plush. Not plush. It's, like... Like, you can see, because the ears are coming off, and I'm gonna need to go back to... Because in, like, a month... Because you're watching this on... At least... The earliest you could watch this is 9-11. Um, so, before you yell at me in the comments for making fun of a national tragedy, um... I thought this video was gonna come out on 9-11, and I didn't think I would make it the editing that fast, so that's why I keep bringing up 9-11. So, yeah. But I'm making this on the 28th of August. So, happy 9-11. I don't know why I'm moving this. It's horrible for sound quality. Ooh. Anyway, it's like, this is like squishy. This is like watery. I don't know how I feel about this. Like, listen. Sounds funny. So, all together, we got a Pasquale squishy head. This didn't come with it. I'll put it back. Give me a second. Some of the times the word Chuck E. Cheese was said in the commercials from 1980 to 2000. Okay, I'm back. We got a Pasquale Squishy. I really think this is the only fidget spinner, but on the box it just takes it out. Got a Chucky fidget spinner. Got a Pasquale um, tech deck. And I'm glad that I got this one and not like a three year old from like like a three-year-old from wherever I am. I'm not telling you. So, and then we got a Pasquale sticker. Well, I, I was saying about the Pasquale stuff, because, like, one time I went to the Chuck E. Cheese store, and I was like... What am I... Where am I going with this? Oh, yeah. So, um, I got one of, like, the solid color figurine things. It's over there. I can see it. It's on the shelf. I'll take a picture of my shelves before and after. I know you don't care. I always say that, but there's like two of you that care, and thank you. That, well anyway, I asked for a, a purple Pasquale, and the lady at the prize counter, she was like, you're the first person ever since I started working here that asked for a Pasquale. So they know. They know. That. Like only Chuck E. Cheese fans make like. Buys Pasquale merch. So. Got a Pasquale sticker. A Pasquale. Um. Squishy head. Uh, Pasquale Tech Deck, I think I already showed you it. Uh, a fidget spinner, which is surprisingly good quality. I wasn't expecting how heavy it would be. Um, a Munch's Make Believe band sticker. A 500, oh no, 500 e-tickets. I don't know if I want to use this or not, but I might... Sorry about that. I might, like, um... I might... Because I know... I'm not going to even say it. But... Wait. Should I... Should I say it? I'll just keep it vague. My birthday's in October. I can use this next month. But if I save up another $20, I'll have a thousand tickets. But if I save up... These are way too expensive, but for the 500 e-tickets, it seems okay. Because, like, if I go to the store for my birthday, because you know how CEC fans are, most of them like to go there, even if they're not a child. So, I might use this, but I might use, like, I might keep one and, like, so do something. And... Yeah. I don't know. So I got a Jasper sticker. 
a Helen sticker. And a Helen trading card. A Helen, uh, no, sorry, a Chuck E. Cheese trading card. And one poster. I really want to. I really like making this style of content, but nobody watches it. And I'm scared that I'm losing popularity. Because, Pharaoh, I know you don't care, but I just need to get this out. <laughs> I might cut this out of the video. Oh, the AC stopped. Oh, well, if, just put in the comments, if you're even watching this, put it, because it's a miracle if you're watching this, just put it in the comments, I would like to see another one of this, if you want, if you genu genuinely want to see a 13 year old open up a mystery egg, and just, or like, I just see a, a cool video about the Chuck E. Cheese mystery egg, or just or like, cause I'm I'm gonna I am going to collect these all of them. Just do you want me to show you guys or not? That's the question. That got deep. So here's all of the stuff. So, yeah. If you're wondering what my Chuck E. Cheese collection looked like before, it's this. So yeah, I had that, and all these. These are pretty cool things, aren't they? And like these. I've been collecting since I've been like seven, so I've accumulated quite a collection. There's all my FNAF stuff, but I won't get in that today. Like, yeah. That's pretty cool, I guess. And, <laughs> oh wow. Oh wow, that looks way better in my opinion. Oh wow. Wow, okay, okay. Okay, I like this. Okay. Um, so, yeah. Um, this is the completed checklist if you're wondering. You can take a picture of that if, bo if it's not clear enough. Too bad, so sad. And so, um, so this is my, as of, like, August 28th. 2024, this is my Chuck E. Cheese collection. I do have other stuff, but most of it's just, like, drawings I made in fourth grade and, like, plates. You know, I should tr just, like, make this its own video, but I'll, I'll go in depth in that video. But this is just a gloss over. So. Um... Thank you for watching this. I know it's a bit long. Uh, thank you for taking time out of your day, even if you could only watch, like, part of it and then watch the rest of it later. Or just didn't watch the rest of it and just watch part of it. Thank you for giving your time to watch my stupid content. And I hope you'll watch part two, if you want a part two. If you do, comment. We want a part two, you silly Billy. So, yeah. And as always, I do not know what time it is when you're watching this, so have a good evening, night, that's the same thing, morning, afternoon, just have a good time.